Hey everybody, what's up? This is Logman Plays. Uh, I am Logman or Logan, uh, and today I'm playing Persist. Now this is the first game uh, I'm going to be playing for my Let's Play channel. This is a really <coughs> uh, sorry cute. It's a really cute and uh, short game. I like it a lot. Super simple, kind of old school graphics and whatnot. Very old school platformer esque. Uh, so let's um, let's jump into it. You. Why have you come here? There is nothing you can accomplish. You are already beyond redemption. So, there's some nice uh, piano music. Turn that down a little bit. There's some nice piano music. Uh... The jumps sound pretty satisfying. Honestly, like, a lot of the sounds in this game remind me of Cave Story. Um, which is a super great game. And this game looks very pretty, I think. It's very simple. It has a very uh, Mario feel to it. Um, very, like, Mario 2. Uh, this jump always gets me. There we go. Okay, so, I've basically started this channel. As a uh, fun, family-friendly... Oh, there we go. There's the death. Fun, family-friendly, uh, user-feedback-based Let's Play channel. Um, I'll put trigger warnings on all my... Oh, boy. On all of my videos, uh, there will be warning for any sort of uh, epilepsy... Uh, you know, like flashing lights and stuff. Anything that could cause seizures. Uh, oh, hey, you... You have entered my sanctuary. What is it that you seek? My forgiveness? Ha 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 ha! After all you've done, you fool! I shall take your arms and watch you drown in the darkness of your heart. Into darkness of your heart. Into the abyss with you! Floors exploding. So now we've lost our arms and the ability to swim. But that's okay, that's not going to stop us. Yup. These waterfalls will disappear. Yup. So, um... I started... I wanted to make my own Let's Play channel because a lot of the Let's Plays I've been watching recently, uh... I'm saying kind of, you know, not, not good stuff. And, uh, I think that should really change. I think Let's Plays are something that everyone should be able to enjoy. Uh... So, that's why I made this channel. Um, so you can have something to enjoy without being worried about... Without having to be worried about anything. Just a fun gameplay channel. I also, uh, I also plan on doing some guides. Maybe for some missions. In just various games. I don't know. If there's stuff you guys want me to do, please, uh... Please just, uh, contact me. I'll have an official Tumblr for this channel. Uh, logmanplays.tumblr.com uh, oh boy, I might mess up here. Oh my god, holy cow. Um, no, wait a second on this one. Uh, so that Tumblr again is logmanplays.tumblr.com. Rats. And I will post, uh, all my videos there. Like, they'll be posted to YouTube, of course. But, uh, I will post them again there. And you can contact me there, as well as just the YouTube, uh, contact page. And uh, that will be my plan for that. So I'm trying to. I'm gonna try to keep every video uh, about ten minutes long, so that way uh, they're in easy bite-sized forms. Wow, I am not good at this part. I'm sorry. Uh, so they're in. You know, they're just easy to digest. Uh, I don't have to record a whole bunch of like data onto my computer. Um. Yeah, so that's playing with that. Um, so this is the first game that I've tried that I'm gonna try to play for the channel, and um, the next game I have planned is Jazz Punk with my partner Allison. Allison is non-binary; they are uh, 17. They will be turning 18 in February. Uh, I am 19. 
and I live in North Carolina. Don't know if that information is relevant, but if you guys want to know it, there it is. Oh, we did it. All right. Sweet. We're out through that. And now we've got this this person talking to us again. You are still here. I see you not give up your goal easily. But I warn you, my forgiveness is not earned easily either. I shall take your legs and laugh as you burn in my wrath. Was that supposed to rhyme? Into the abyss with you. I don't know if that was supposed to rhyme or not. So it's about Christmas time. Uh, which is cool. And uh, what do you guys ask for for Christmas? I myself have asked for a, a better mic to record these with. Because uh, right now I'm just using my uh, eternal... Etern <laughs> the mic is forever. My internal mic on my... Uh, on my computer, but I have uh, asked for a blue sky snowball mic. It, it's like a little white sphere, and uh, hopefully that'll get the audio sounding better. This this video is mostly just to test how um, how long this game takes, and just to see if people uh, whoop yeah blah, blah. see if people like uh, like what I've got going. What else did I ask for Christmas this year? Oh, I, um, I've been getting into Fallout New Vegas. Uh, not getting into it, I've loved that game for a while. But one thing I've discovered that I really loved are the old, like, cowboy songs on there. And, uh, I recently purchased a guitar. Um, I play bass, bass guitar, electric bass. Um, but I've never played acoustic guitar. And my friend, uh, Erica, sold me one for about $60. It was the, the deal of a lifetime. Um... And so I'm going to... Okay, I need to wait for that to get a little bit lower to jump it. Um, and so I'm thinking about getting, like, a cowboy, uh, like, songbook with, uh, like, chords and stuff in it to play on guitar. Because, I don't know, the old, like, cowboy songs in, like, American history, uh, like, frontier history, super, super cool to me. Because it was such a, like, such a strange time. Not strange, uh... Such a undiscovered time, I guess, in America's history, um, where like a lot of people like didn't really know what was going on. There wasn't a whole lot of law. A lot of it was based on um, like gold mining and just uh... oh rats! I almost heard that jump. Oh no, it's all the way over. Uh, a lot of it was based on like gold mining and herding and stuff like that. Um, that being said, I love uh, cowboy and western type games. Uh, Fallout New Vegas is probably my favorite game. Uh, with Gunman Clive. I played that for the 3DS. That's a very fun cowboy-esque game. That being said, though, I actually um, have not played a lot of Red Dead Redemption. Probably the most popular cowboy-esque game, I would say. Uh, mostly because I don't have it for my Xbox, and, um, my roommate had it, and he let me play it, but, uh, it was pretty fun, but it, was, it wasn't as cool as New Vegas, honestly. If there was, like, a first-person shooter type western-y game, like Skyrim, but western-y, I guess, like, in the, like, because, you know, Fallout is, Fallout New Vegas is in, like, post-apocalyptic, futuristic western-y um, but, like, something that would actually be, like, like, mid-1800s, or, sorry, uh, late-1800s, because a lot of, whew, excuse me, a lot of cowboys and stuff were actually soldiers from the Civil War. Wow, excuse me. Um, were soldiers from the Civil War that went there, and, uh, so a lot of, a lot of what was happening, uh, in the West and, like, Western history happened. Not a lot of it happened after the Civil War, but a larger, a larger uh, migration of people uh, came to the West after the Civil War. So yeah, if there was a game based on that, I would absolutely play that for sure. You have lost your body, but not your resolve. Sorry, I wasn't doing the commentary for the other part. 
So now I am invisible. Oh, I died. Okay. You can tell that I just have these little sparkly things going for me. Oop. Nailed it. Nailed it. Yeah. Alright. What I like about this game is that it's very simple. I really love simplistic games. Did I die? No, I didn't die. I'm up here. Um, very simple. It it feels snappy, I guess. It feels snappy in the same way that Cave Story felt snappy, I guess. Because Cave Story, to me, I don't know if you guys have played that, but it, uh, it, you, you, your little dude, little robot guy, and you'll jump around and have this sweet, like, laser gun that you can fire and stuff. And, uh, oh, what's going on here? I can feel a presence. You? I have taken everything you have, but still you persist. How? I see it now. You honestly feel remorse for your past actions. And that has allowed your soul to linger a little longer. Now that you have finally reached me, what is it that you want? What? You would give up your soul to save mine and undo your actions? Oh. Would you really do that? Oh. This thing is cracking open. It kind of reminds me of Bayonetta. I forgive you. Dang. Doctor! The woman they brought in. Her condition has stabilized. I thought she was not going to make it. Excellent news. I guess miracles do happen. I like to imagine them saying that, like, how about her assailant? I like to imagine them saying that, like, looking up into the sky and, like, a light comes in through the window. It's like, I guess miracles do happen. His condition got worse. We tried our hardest when his condition got critical. But he is no longer with us. Alright, guys, so that was Persist. Um... Super fun game. Uh, tell your friends. Um, if you're wondering what the ending was about, oh, oh wow, it was created under 48 hours. I didn't know that. Theme minimalism. Um, so what was happening at the end there was the whole story behind it is that a woman, I guess, was attacked or robbed or something, and uh, her and her robber. They were both uh, injured, and I guess very badly. Um, so the attacker gives up his life for... Uh, somehow there's like souls entwined in there and stuff. And he, he basically gives up his own life and his own soul to save the woman because he is remorseful for his actions and wants to genuinely uh, help the woman out. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Watching. Uh, I will have more videos up, and if you want to suggest something to me, that'd be super awesome. Thank you guys so much. Bye!